What's up everybody? Today I'm doing my everyday makeup routine. This is the look that I will go for if I need to run out and run some errands, but I wanna look halfway cute while I'm doing it. I like this look because it's very quick and easy, but still beautiful at the same time. So if you would like to see how I get this look, then just keep watching. First, I'm gonna start off by tight lighting my upper lash line and my lower waterline using a black waterproof eyeliner. Next, I'm gonna take my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer and prime my entire face. And now I've decided to do a little color correcting using MAC Studio Concealer in the color Pure Orange. And next for my absolute favorite foundation, it is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation in the stick form. And I just apply that all over my face and then I'm gonna blend it in with my damp beauty blender. And I also take it onto my eyelids as well because it's gonna help with my shadows later on. For my highlight, I'm gonna use my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Caramel. And I'm just gonna apply that under my eyes, on my forehead, my cupid's bow and chin, and then blend that all in with my damp beauty blender. Next, I'm gonna take my Sasha Cosmetics Compact Setting Powder in the color Buttercup, and I'm going to apply that to all of the areas that I highlighted, and then immediately dust it off with a fluffy brush. And now for my contour, I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit in medium to tan. I'm gonna take the darkest brown shade in that kit and contour my entire face using an angled face brush. Next, I'm taking my Sasha Cosmetics Buttercup Setting Powder and I'm going to apply that right underneath my contour to define that line just a little bit more and then immediately dust it off. Now I'm taking my BH Cosmetics Rose Blush Duo and I'm taking the pink color in that set and applying it on my cheeks for my blush. And then taking the light champagne color, I'm going to apply that to the high points of my cheekbones for my highlight. Now moving to eyes, I'm going to prime my entire eyelids using the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Now for my favorite everyday palette is the BH Cosmetics It's Judy Time Palette. It was limited edition, so I don't know if it's still available, but I'm taking the cream eyeshadow and applying it right underneath my brow. And then I'm gonna take the soft brown eyeshadow and apply it to my entire lid for my transition color. Next, I'm taking this light gold eyeshadow and applying it to my lid with an eyeshadow brush. And then I'm gonna take an eyeshadow blending brush and blend that gold into that soft brown that we added before. And now I'm taking this dark chocolate brown eyeshadow and applying it just to the outer corners of my eyes and then blending it into my crease. And now going in with MAC Shroom Eyeshadow, which is just a white frost color. I'm going to apply that to the inner corners of my eyes and then blending it in. Now I'm taking my Ardell Double Up Lashes in the style 203. You can pick something that is not so dramatic, but I'm just gonna apply those and then apply mascara to my top and lower natural lashes. Now to finish off this everyday look, I'm going to wear a nude lip. So I'm going to use the NYX Lip Pencil in Nutmeg and then go on top of that with Max Honey Love Lipstick and then blend the two together. Now moving on to my hair, even for an everyday look, I still like to wear one of my units. So I just put my hair in a very low bun apply my stocking cap, and the unit that I am wearing today is the Outre Lace Front Wig in the style Brazilian, and it is in the color DR2730. I received this wig from wigtypes.com, and I will have all of the links and information in the description bar below. And here is our finished look. Well, there you have it. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button below. I love you all so, so much for watching. And until next time, please remember that none of us are perfect, but we are definitely beautiful inside and out.